Here I am standing in front of a Hall Marcus original called Fruitopia. It is a very large mixed media on canvas. The colors are warm, but there seems to be a lot of sym symmetry going on. The artist has drawn literal lines that could cut the geometry perfectly in half. Another Hall Marcus original, Three Graces, on a 30 by 24 inches mixed media on canvas. It is very abstract, as you can see and recognize the women, but it doesn't seem very natural. Five Sisters is another Hall Marcus original. This one caught my attention right away because of the overlapping space, creating the illusion of depth between the close sisters. It is a very large mixed medium on canvas. Not that large, just medium large. So I actually need to do this pretty quickly because they are kind of kicking me out. Um, apparently they were closed for the day and only came in for a few minutes. Um, another one that caught, another artist that caught my attention is Jose Cisneros who is an illustrator of our culture, specifically horsemen and horses. Um, his family lost everything in the Mexican Revolution and came to live in El Paso with his family. His passion for art sparked when he was a student at Lydia Patterson. I noticed that his drawings are very naturalistic and they are mostly pen and ink on regular sized paper. This section of the gallery is focused on artist Tom Leah. This one is called the first surgical operation in North America, Cabeza de Vaca. It's a medium-sized pencil on natural vellum. There's also detail from, detail from Female Nude Edition 1.3. It is a brown pastel on natural vellum. Very naturalistic, gentle strokes, which make it seem very feminine. Right next to it is a small Nude Study Edition number 17. Simple but beautiful, simple pencil on paper. Okay guys, this is the third gallery that I come to and it's finally open, so we're gonna do this one. I am at Crossland Gallery. Let's go on. So this one right here is done by Mario Uyua. The title of this is My Angel Jockey. And as you can see, it is very naturalistic because you can see that this child right here is an angel it has the wings it has cardio scudo so then it's very natural very you can see that the attention is drawn to the light and so is the baby and here right here it's a little bit darker very natural this one right here is also by mario yua and it's called iglesia san pedro um obviously by the name you can tell that it is referring to the church behind this man right here and i don't know if i mentioned but mario you is actually an, a local artist so i felt like this represented our culture very well this is also by mario Ojoa, and it is acrylic on canvas this painting actually is from his collection hello beautiful um when the el paso art association wanted to have him for display at our galleries they actually asked him if he could paint a mural and he agreed they needed it to be something quick so then they agreed upon this mural over here by the wall this is the mural that the el paso art association wanted mario Ujo to paint and i ran into some classmates thought you might enjoy that so that would be it thank you